Hello Daily Dose of Epic, it is Monday, uh, May 23rd, and I am thoroughly exhausted, if you cannot already tell. So this weekend was prom weekend. Um, I like to describe it as an event where teenagers spend up to nine hours getting ready for a single photo, and then they um, conjugate in a very dark room and jump up and down to very shitty music, usually provided by a middle-aged white man DJ. Um, and they end up ruining everything they work for for nine hours by sweating and increased hormones. So it's pretty disgusting, but you take from it what you can. Uh, overall, for me, it was pretty mediocre due to the fact that they played really slow down pop music. Like, I don't understand how you can slow it to catch a song, but they managed to, so that wasn't fun. Um, and a majority of the people left after like an hour and a half into it all. Um, but afterwards it was fun. My friend and I hit up a 7-Eleven and just got a lot of junk, junk food and went down to the beach and hung out there for a while and um, got bitten by bugs, prayed to uh, not get raped by shady guys passing by, and um, what else did I write down? That was a hit. It was, so it was obviously a classy night clearly from everything I've stated so far. And here's a picture of my dress. Just refrain from looking at the severely awkward expression on my face. Uh, I don't know how if it's gonna flip when I put it on, but obviously you'll tell who I am, the girl to the left or right of me is my friend Lily and also my date. Productive things I did this weekend include finishing Slaughterhouse Five. Um, it's definitely because become one of my favorite books of all time, and I've definitely found a new love for Kurt Vonnegut. I haven't really read a lot of his works before, and I'm definitely planning on pursuing reading books like Cat's Cradle and his other works. Um, I think I really like this one because I really love when a book changes my perspective on life or gives me coping mechanisms that aren't unhealthy. Um, and I don't know, I just like when books make life seem not as hard as it is. They simplify it, which I don't know if that makes sense, but it makes sense in my head. Um, I also just adore the main character because I personally find him tremendously relatable, even though he's seen as this emotionless psychopath. Um, he's just really lovable. If you've read it, I'd love to know what you think about it because it's definitely a questionable book. Um, so leave a comment because I'd love to hear your opinions. Um, I haven't really debated with anyone about the book, so I'd love to do that. And uh, another point is that I really need to start reading more often. Um, so if you have any book recommendations, talk about it in the video and leave a comment because I'm probably just going to end up rereading the Harry Potter series over again. Oh, I always need your guys' help with everything. Um, I'm doing a project for history in which we pick a historical musician, so I chose David Bowie. Um, would have picked Bob Dylan, but I was not there the day that everyone got to choose, so I got the short end of the stick. Um, so along with the research, which obviously says to do, like, if I, you know, his biography and stuff, um, we have to create a, uh, creative response or, like, slash representation. So if you guys have any ideas, um, I'll love you forever if you, uh, have any ideas. Because as of right now, I'm gonna be really cliche and probably take a picture of myself or someone else with, like, the red Bowie stripe. And, um, yeah, so, on a Daily Dose of Epic note, um, I enjoyed your staying destiny. Sarah, I'm envious of your room color. I've always wanted to color my room a different color, but as you can see, these are kind of, like, this is the color of, like, my whole house. It's disgusting. Um, Ben, I already told you, uh, your video was epic, and you definitely lived up to my expectations, so, good job. Um, insert cheesy smile here. That was so disgusting, I'm sorry. That was, that was not cute. Blah. So I have a headache that feels like it's slowly consuming uh, my brain. So I have to go now. But I will be back next week with a hopefully more entertaining video where I don't ramble all the time. So TFTBA. <laughs>